The third is a point I want to make. Uh, Madam Chair, there's a real dilemma for rural America, and the dilemma is that the big cable companies and the big telecom companies have a business model that is very much oriented towards making money, which is easier to do in the dense urban populations, and they're leaving us in the rural areas behind. And that's true whether you're Senator Schmidt in, with uh, Missouri or you're in rural Northeast Kingdom, Vermont. And we have in Vermont community uni union districts, and those have been empowered with, lo with local authority to make decisions where they're on the hook to make certain that that farmer at the end of the dirt road has high-speed internet. That's the objective, not maximizing the profit. Is that a model that you see as being helpful to guarantee that rural folks with not much economic clout are gonna get what they absolutely need? Yeah, I love that model. And in fact, the infrastructure law requires the states to confer with local communities. And if they're not doing that, that's something that NTIA needs to, to, to look and make sure that is happening. 